You want Forge mods? Let's show you how to get them. First link in the description down below is where you're going to start. It's going to take you here, which is our in-depth guide on how to install Forge in Minecraft. Once you're here, you just want to click this download button, but if you prefer a text guide, it's all outlined here as well. Once you click download, it will take you to Forge's official download page, where you want to select 1.21.11 on the left-hand side, because that's the version we're installing in this video. Then come under Download Latest, click on Installer, and it will take you off to Add Focus, where you don't want to click a single thing on this page. You want to wait about 10 seconds, and then add after about 10 seconds, a red skip add button is going to appear in the top right. There it is, skip. Once you click that skip button, Forge will begin downloading. As long as Forge is in the title here, you are good to go ahead and click save and the download will begin. Now we can go ahead and minimize our browser and Forge is going to be in our downloads folder here. Now we can install this. We're good to go if you can open it. How do you open it? We'll just right click on it, click on open with and click Java. But if for whatever reason you don't have this here, what you need to do is download Java. 21 and run the jar fix. Java 21 is as easy as coming here, clicking download, and then getting the Windows installer right here and downloading and installing it, right? Just click download and install it like any other program. The jar fix is the same. You just run it basically, download this, run the program, and you'll be good to go after you get Java. Now at this point, we can go ahead and open up Forge by right clicking on it, clicking open with, clicking Java, and the Forge installer will open. All you got to do is click install client and click OK. And while this is installing, how do I from our hosting provider, Simple Game Hosting? Go to the first link in the description down below to start your very own Minecraft server where you can easily install Forge mods. You can also add plugins to your server and even one click install hundreds of mod packs. Truly, you can customize your server any way that you want and there's even expert live chat support there to help you out along the way. So don't struggle to start a Minecraft server. Start your server the simple way at the first link in the description down below. The breakdown.xyz slash sgh. Nonetheless, as you can see, Forge is successfully installed. We can click OK. It will close out of that. You can actually delete the Forge installer. Now at this point, you probably want some Forge mods as well. So let's go ahead and get those. Curse Forge and Moderant are the most popular places to download mods and when you're downloading them make sure you're filtering for forge and then the game version 1.21.11 in this case there's tons of mods out there that you can get for example biomes of plenty is a super popular forge mod so we can go ahead and go to files here and we will want to get that 1.21.11 forge version however if we just downloaded this it actually wouldn't work and that's because if we click on it and go to related projects we can see that glitch core and Terra blender are required dependencies you've got to have both of these in a addition to Bombs of Plenty for this to work. So if we download Bombs of Plenty here, which we'll go ahead and do, we'll also need to download both of those. Now I'm going to do that on Moderinth because, well, I want to show you how to find those on Moderinth as well. So if we come here, we can obviously filter for 1.21.11 and Forge, but we can also search for Biomes of Plenty. Once we go here and go to versions, we will be able to click on this Forge version and see again Glitch Core and Terra Blender, where we want to go to both of their respective pages and make sure that we download both of them again for that Forge 1.21. 11 version. So with both of these downloaded, we can now put it all together and get it installed. So we want to go ahead and open up the Minecraft launcher. And then in the Minecraft launcher, you can launch Minecraft before installing your mods, but you don't have to. You can install your mods now, basically meaning you don't have to restart Minecraft after you launch. So just go to installations and hover over your Forge installation. Then click the folder icon that appears. This will open your Minecraft folder where you should have a mods folder. If you don't, like I don't, you can just go ahead and make one. Just make a new folder and title it mods and then open your newly created mods folder. Now we want to drag and drop any of the mods we want to install right here into this folder. In our case, that's going to be Terra Blender, Glitch Core, and of course, Biomes of Plenty, which is what we're actually looking for here, Biomes. Now we can play Minecraft using Forge, and those mods will be installed and working. I will show you that once we get in game. So here we are in game. We can instantly see we have spawned in a Biomes of Plenty biome. Uh, there's, there's no real denying that. I don't even know what, uh, what wood this is. Mahogany log. So there you have it. That's how you can get Forge mods in Minecraft 1.21.11. If you've got any questions, let us know in the comments. We will try our best to help you out. But we will see you in the next video. And I am out. Peace.